You need to surround yourself with people who are going to stimulate, inspire, and lift you up, who are going to give you energy and not take energy away from you. And if you're around people who are taking energy away from you, that's an energy drain. And that is the sign from your instinct, your inner voice, your intuition to say, let them go. Wow. Yeah. Wow. When you look at successful people, you have talked to everyone in the yeah, world who is successful. What would you say is the one common characteristic that you find gets people to where they want to go? Um, the, the most important question is, uh, the people get to where they want to go because they know where they want to go. Oh, wow. And most people don't know where they want to go. Most people, a lot of people, are going and being driven by what they think they should do, right. what other people say they should do, what they have carried in their mind for a long time they should do. But the most important question you can ever ask yourself is what do I really want. Wow. And the answer to that, once you can establish for yourself what the answer to that is, and have everything you do, every choice you make, move you in the direction of what you say your vision is. Right. Yeah. And when you do that, the, 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 the forces of life rise up to meet you. The reason why most people have such chaotic lives is because they're living in chaos in their head. And as soon as you get clear, it clears up. And what your real job is to do is to come to the world and understand that your job is to figure out what it is you have to offer. Right. Like what you do every night looks like a talk show, but what you're offering us is relief. What you're offering us is a way to see ourselves differently. What you're offering us is humor, but what you're offering us is a way in to see our culture. And that is what you do. And so it's bigger than a talk show. It's bigger than just this moment with you and I sitting in the chair. Wow. Because what you are broadcasting to the world is this sort of essence of yourself. You know, your purpose is greater than, than this moment in this chair. But I had been, been demoted from the news because I was too emotional. I would get too engaged in the stories. I would go, yes, I was too emotional. And I was always getting written up for being too emotional with the stories. And so had I not been demoted, I probably would have for a long time continued on that path because my father was like, they're paying you $25,000. You better keep that job. So <laughs> I would have stayed for all the wrong reasons instead of taking what looked like a failure in the moment and being demoted. Right. And then the moment I sat down on my first talk show, I thought, I have come home to myself. And that's what everybody is looking for the path that allows you to come home to yourself. A great reward and joy comes from being able to lift other people up. Right. To, 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 to look back or reach back and lift other people to the highest level of themselves, because that's really what we're all looking for. Right. That's what I say in here, that the reason why there is common ground for all of us is because you want the same thing I want. And even in my position in life, I'm still reaching for what is the truest, highest expression of myself as a human being. Wow. That's the path you're looking for. And when you know that that's what we're all looking for, so my job is I think I've found that and I continue to find it by helping other people to find that for themselves.